Hello children and welcome back children today i have a question for you the question is have you ever wished for something and was that wish granted but uh, tell me did you uh, find anything going wrong after that wish was granted well something like this happened with me and i would like to share my experience with you all you know when i was in your age i wished for many candies and chocolates i wished wished and kept wishing for the same then one day my parents came home with lot of candies and chocolates okay and i got so happy so happy i said oh my wish is granted but my parents told me iv you supposed to share this with your siblings you're not supposed to eat it all alone i told them all right i'll do that but i did not share it with anyone i did not share it with my siblings my brothers and i kept eating it one after the other till when it did not get over and then what happened what happened can you guess yes i had a severe toothache and it was so painful i had terrible pain and it was hurting me very badly so then i got a lesson children can you guess what was the lesson that i got that i should not be greedy i should share my things with others too and then what i did after that oh you are saying that ivy ma'am you stopped eating candies and chocolates no i still eat chocolates and candies but now i don't eat that much and i also share it with others okay so now children in today's story today we are going to read out a story and understand what is the moral of the story now this story is from your revised oxford new pathways enrichment reader chapter 4 a greedy rich man in this story there is a rich man who has lot of wealth but he keeps on wishing for more more and more so let us start with a greedy rich man this is the story of a very rich man even though he was rich he always wanted more money and more wealth now children what is the meaning of wealth wealth means riches okay wealth means riches so riches means wealth wealth means riches so this man had lot of wealth but still he wanted more he was greedy and his riches never seemed enough he was so greedy that whatever he had it never seemed enough for him he wanted more one day he was walking through his apple orchard now what is orchard children orchard means garden so one day when he was walking through his apple orchard his garden apple garden checking the harvest harvest children harvest means crop okay how many apples have grown in his garden he was checking that and he was counting the money he would make so he was counting oh so many apples oh how much money i'm going to make then suddenly in the shade of a tree he saw a strange looking creature it was a fairy the fairy was caught in a few branches what is the meaning of caught caught means stuck he saw a strange looking creature and it was a fairy the fairy was caught in few branches she was stuck in a few branches realizing he had a fantastic opportunity to become rich he asked the fairy for a wish in return for its freedom now children what is the meaning of realizing realizing means understanding fantastic means wonderful and opportunity means chance so understanding that he had a wonderful chance to become rich he asked the fairy that fairy i'll set you free only if you grant me my wish he said if i save you you must grant me the power to turn all that i touch into gold now what did he ask he said that if i save you you have to grant me the power to turn whatever he touches should turn into gold now he, this is what he wanted the fairy was tired of being stuck in the branches she was so tired stuck in the branches that she 
readily agreed. Okay, okay, I will grant your wish. The greedy man rushed home to tell his wife and daughter about this new gift that he got. He could not hold back his excitement when the stones and pebbles he touched as he ran home turned into gold. It was amazing. Children, what is the meaning of pebbles? Pebbles means small stones. Okay, so he could not hold back his excitement when the stones and the small stones, the pebbles that he touched turned into gold. Hearing his shouting and laughing, his wife and daughter rushed out of their room to see what was happening. When they heard him shouting and laughing, they were curious to know what happened and they rushed out of their room to see what was happening. His daughter ran to him excitedly, laughing out loud, seeing her father's joy. As soon as he bent down and scooped her up in his arms, she turned into a gold statue. Now children, whenever your dad returns home from office, you also do this, isn't it? You go running and you hug your father. So similarly, this girl also did the same thing. And as he scooped, what is the meaning of scooped? Picked, okay? As he picked her up in his arms, she turned into a gold statue. The rich man cried, his wife cried, but their daughter did not move or respond. She was now a gold statue. Children, what is the meaning of respond? To answer. Okay. The rich man was crying, his wife was crying, but the daughter was not moving. She was not responding because she had turned into a gold statue. Can you see here in this image how this little girl has turned into gold statue because her father touched her, isn't it? The rich greedy man realized his folly. He understood that he should not be greedy and should in fact help others too. Now what is the meaning of realized? I already told you realized means understood. Okay. And what is the meaning of folly? Folly means mistake. So the rich greedy man now understood his mistake. He understood that he should not be greedy and he should in fact help others too. He went to search for the fairy who had granted him this wish. After a few days, he found her in a nearby forest. Now he didn't know where the fairy had disappeared. So he went to search out for the fairy. And then after a few days, he found her in a nearby forest. He requested the fairy to take back this gift so that his daughter could return to her original form. He promised to be a good man. So children, he requested the fairy to take back the gift because he wanted his daughter not as a gold statue but he wanted his daughter to be the way she was in her original form and he promised the fairy that he will be a good man. Seeing that the man was truly sorry, the fairy took back the gift. The man ran back to his house and saw all the pebbles that had turned to gold were back to normal. Now he went he was on his way back. He was very happy because he was seeing that the pebbles, the stones that had turned into gold were again into its normal form. He entered his house and his daughter was waiting for him. He hugged her tightly. The man was never greedy again and shared his riches with everyone. Now children, can you see how this man changed? He now became a good man. He was never greedy again and he learned to share his riches with everyone. So children, can you tell me the moral of the story? The moral of the story is we should always be happy with what we have and we should not be greedy. Thank you children for watching my video. I hope you all loved the story and I hope you all are going to, you know, implement this and apply this in your life. You're never going to be greedy and you are going to be very happy with whatever you have. Okay, so children take care. Bye-bye. See you in the next video.